everyone and welcome back to my channel what's up so this video is going to be about my beauty room i'm going to give you guys like a little tour of everything you know so i'm going to start with this chair of course i got this chair from wayfair this it's like it's basically an air mattress but it's shaped like a bean bag pretty comfortable i have some pillows on it just to make it even more comfortable and then there's like a blanket under this i might switch it out i want something more of like an ottoman or something like that so I don't know, I'm gonna shop around, you know, look at my options and whatnot. The next thing I have is this shelf. Um, originally, my makeup table was over here. I ended up switching it around because I just wanted something a little bit more different. So the first thing I have is this plant. I got this plant from Target. And it was probably like $5, I don't know, something like that. I have this candle that I got from Ross. It's pumpkin seeds and sandalwood. I brand a lot, like, a lot i actually have to clean it but yeah the next thing i have is this little i don't even know what it's called but it's so cute but tell me how i had something like this that was bigger right but i'm so clumsy guys to the point where it actually broke you know how when you go to like ross and everything and tj maxx and they wrap it up for you yeah i got right to the front door of my house and i banged it on the front door and it cracked and it was a bigger one that i had so i recently got rid of it so i wanted to recreate it so i just took some of the um, some of the what to call the rocks that were in there and then i kind of just put them in here with the plant and everything and then i just put the lights on top well the, the, i put the lights around it so i thought that was really cute so i actually just threw out the other one um earlier today and then I have these pine cones. They're like scented. Um, what's the scent? Oh, the scent, it's vanilla bean. So I just wanted to, you know, have it smell kind of good in here. This bowl is actually from the kitchen. It doesn't get used at all, so that's why I'm using it. So don't judge me and think I'm, you know, I'm gonna take this bowl back and put it back in the kitchen. No. <laughs> and then I have this other plant. This plant was originally in my other room, but I kind of just threw it on here. So, you know, just to give it a little, little vibe and everything. I really want to put something on this wall. I feel like it's just too bland. I just need something here. So if you guys have any ideas, you know, then let me know. Okay, the next thing I have is this cabinet. I got this cabinet from um, Impressions Vanity. And I got this a couple months ago, probably back in August or September I got this. I guess that's some incense and some sage that I burned earlier, but I don't really use it that much every now and then. And then I have this little plant my mom got. Um, I think these are dandelions, you know? I don't really know anything about, you know, nature and flowers and stuff, but I think that is a dandelion. I'm not completely sure. Yeah, these are all just like my hair products and everything. So like hair gels, hairsprays, you know, things like that. I try to keep it as organized as much as I can. I don't know, It's it's been rough. I probably have to work like reorganize this maybe every one to two weeks something like that and then i guess I have this one i actually got these containers from target and they're actually probably like seven or eight dollars and i have two of them actually this one is just filled with um styling tools so like hot combs and um flat irons and blow dryers and stuff like that and then in this one you probably can't see it because it's black like everything in my room this one is just full of um, blow dryer attachments so like a, de a, a diffuser there's like another one you know like things like, you know things like that you know and this one is just full of combs um, combs brushes and stuff like that I actually have to clean those and then this one is just you know like um, you know hair clips and scrunchies and hair ties and then rubber bands and stuff like I said, I really try to keep it clean in here because it starts to get messy and then I just, it gets overwhelming and I don't know what to do. So this is where I keep all of my hair products. And the next thing I have over here is my Cinema Secrets brush cleaner. Guys, I love this brush cleaner, especially when I'm going to be doing my makeup at least, you know, two times in a, in a day. Or I just need to clean up my brush really quick to switch a shadow. I use this brush cleaner. This was about $40 and I got this from the, the website. And I guess refill it in my little bottle because I have um, a smaller one. The next thing I have is this uh, cabinet thing that I showed you guys earlier. So yeah, I got this from Impressions Vanity. This was about, I think it was $150. I really didn't know which one to get. But I thought this one was pretty cute. And I love the knobs on this. Yeah, I guess try to keep everything somewhat organized in here. 
So in the first drawer, everything is basically like my eye products, some like mascaras, eyeliners and cake liners, all of my eyebrow products, and my lash glue and everything. This one is just filled with glitter. The next one is just all of my eyeshadow palettes. I have a lot of Anastasia palettes because when I first got into makeup, that was the first brand that I actually, you know, connected with. So that's why I can have a lot of Anastasia products. I have some couple, but these are all like Morphe in the back. You know, just, you know, trying to keep it clean, you know. And the next one, these are all of my bronzers and my highlighters and blushes and my blushes and stuff like that. I'm trying to find a way to organize this a little bit better because I don't know what was going on with this. I was trying to like, you know, lift this up. So I had to like cut it and everything, but it was just, it's a hot mess. The next one is just foundations, concealers, and primers and everything like that. These are all of my foundations. And then these are all of my concealers and everything. Oh gosh, I'm making noise. <laughs> and then in the back, I guess I have all of my primers. I got this tray from, where did I go to get this? I got this from Marshall's Home Goods. And then they were actually, I think they're maybe like $12. I'm not completely sure. I'm going to say $12 because I think I spent no more than $12. And I got two of them. Three, you get three small ones and then you get one big one. The next thing I have in here are like my lashes. These are from lashes from Miss AOA and my lash barb lashes. That my tray is beyond empty, but my cup is full of lashes. And I really have to clean this. It's really hard to clean every now and then. The next one I have is these are filled with all my powders, it's all of my setting powders and everything. And these are just um, these are just my um like my bronzing palettes and everything and a highlighting palette and contouring palettes so i try to keep this somewhat separate i actually got this tray from ross the next drawer i have are all my lip products so like all my lip liners lip glosses and everything and these are all of my matte lipsticks <laughs> and these are all of my lip glosses guys i'm like addicted to gloss and stuff Ooh. i'm not gonna lie sometimes these drawers are hard to close so the next thing I have are like, like Q-tips and things like that. There's got like, some lotion in here. This is just like my messy drawers and some some saline to clean my piercings. The like, these last two drawers are just like sometimes junk stuff. And this one I have. Oh my gosh, I actually love these because my mom got them. Okay, so these are like little like travel size containers that you can take around with you. And I actually use these on the go. And it comes with like a little label and everything. And then there's actually like a funnel or something, an applicator, not an applicator. It's like a spatula to scoop out product and stuff. So I have like a bunch of these because I love to use these. And these are just my face masks. My friend actually gave this to me. It's like the Indian clay mask, but you know, it's from the dermatologist. And this is my jungle clay from, this is the jungle clay mask from Pure Tropics. I'm running low on that, so I have to get another one. And I just have some aloe down here. In this cup, you know when you go to Sephora and you get like little samples and stuff? So that's really what I did with it because I didn't want to waste them. And I actually have these face masks that my best friend gave me. And you actually, you know, you kind of like make your own face mask. So you wet it and you put it on your face and it's like the sheet one. So you kind of just, it'll, it opens up and everything. I do not use these Neutrogena makeup wipes. And I'm going to tell you guys why because they're just horrible. And when you go to Sam's Club, you know, it's like they do like the big bulk thing. So five came in a box. That's why I have so many. And they have, and I, I, it came with at least like 10 of these Neutrogena it's really small ones. So this is like one single one. But I actually do keep these. I keep these in my purse just in case if I'm drunk off my butt and I just need to take my makeup off like really stat that like that's what i'm gonna do like i don't have a choice so the next thing i have is our ring lights i use this ring light for my mic i usually just put it right there but i have a mic on the camera right now and then i have this led light that i got from uh best buy and this this is the platinum one this was about a hundred dollars and it comes with a little remote i'll show you guys later so you know it's little things like that and you can change the lighting and everything i'm looking I'm looking pretty busted, so I'm really not gonna show you guys me, but you know, just everything that's pretty much here. This is the makeup table that I have. 
guys i love this table it has additional pieces to it so where you can like put like bring the table out more and it has another piece of glass that goes on top but it kind of creates an l if that makes sense but i took off the l part because i feel like i figured it was just too much and i really didn't need all that i got this table from i think it's from ashley furniture i believe it's like a glass top table the next thing i have is this flawless fridge my best friend actually got this for me for christmas and oh my gosh i love her because i told her i was thinking about it and i was like oh my god i really want one of those fridge to keep my skincare products and then she actually went and got one for me and i was so happy so i kind of just keep that right here and i love it because like it actually looks like a real fridge guys like it has the whole pull and everything like oh my gosh it just looks so cute and it has a handle on top of it just in case if you want to like you know pick it up and everything okay so the next thing i have is this vanity mirror i got this from bed bath and beyond and this was probably about twenty dollars and it does have a light and everything and i keep this plugged in to my mirror so yeah i think that's the brand the next thing i have is my lovely impressions vanity mirror i'm gonna show you guys this is what it looks like it has 12 bulbs and I actually switched the bulbs out because I went to Lowe's and I bought these LED ones. I forgot what they I forgot what they are. Let me see if I can read the bulb just in case. Oh, these are the LED refresher lights. Forgot which one this is. I will tell you guys the which one it is. Because you know they have so many of them. Oh my gosh, I don't have a bra on. Oh my goodness. Freaking free balling today. So the next thing I have are my brushes. I'm gonna show you guys. I actually just washed them, so that's probably why they're just sitting like that. I have these brush holders from Sony Kashuk. I got these from Target, and they were about like six dollars a piece. And I really just wanted something white, and then you know it has like the gold on top, so I thought that was really cute. So I got three of them. I prefer to use three: one for dirty brushes, one for big brushes, and then one for smaller brushes. And then I just keep my my setting spray in front of me because you know i'm always spraying my face like every five seconds so that's that the next thing i have is this tray i could have sworn i cleaned this oh it's probably underneath okay so the next thing i have is this tray i got this from target and what i do is when i'm doing my makeup i put everything in here so i put all of my little things so mascaras and concealers and eyebrow products and lash glue just to keep everything somewhat clean and everything's not you know all over the table and the next thing i have is um, this is um what is this it's an eyeshadow palette holder so just like the tray i use this to keep my eyeshadow palettes and my little bronzers and stuff like that and i just put this here because i don't know where else to put it <laughs> and yeah so that's pretty much everything that's right there the next thing is this oh it's like the clear acrylic uh drawer or something like that i got it from i think i got it from tj maxx yeah i got it from tj maxx so i got these this cotton run holder i got this from bed bath and beyond this q-tip holder oh my gosh sorry guys <laughs> you know i got that from bed bath and beyond as well and then i just keep my nose rings in there because i'm always losing them so i keep losing all, all of them the next thing I have are these um, face mask applicators. The one side is to stir and this one is to apply, but this is like a silicone. And I do clean these every time I use them because I clean them with this alcohol. That's why I keep alcohol like right next to me and everything. And this one just has all of my camera stuff. So this is the top for my camera. These are just some extra, um, extra SD cards. This is the remote for the LED light that I showed you that was over there. And then these are just the tops for my camera and just something to clean my lens with. The next one, I just keep some scissors and tweezers and everything. And this is just my lash applicator and my sharpener for, you know, my lip pencils and stuff. And yes, I, it's just, it's just in there, but it shows me I clean these every time I use them. The next one is full of my beauty blenders. These just these just have to be clean. That's why they're just sitting in there. And I like to put them on a napkin so they're not just, you know, nakedly sitting on there. And I have this mirror. This this was actually something that was um what was this? This was connected to um something else, but I took the mirror off because I just wanted it to be bigger. 
so the next thing I have is this chair I got this from I think I got some bed bath and beyond as well yeah I think I did and it's you know it's kind of like this swirly chair and it, it actually goes up and down so it has the thing I just can't reach it right now and actually the last thing I have in here is this rug actually no I lied this is not the last thing I got this rug from Marshall's Home Goods and it's like gold it has like little specks of gold and yellow so it's like black gray clearly it's white too and gold and yellow so I'm gonna show you guys this I recently made a backdrop and I used PVC pipe I, um, I'll link her YouTube down below so you guys can check her out so I just went to Walmart and I bought this fabric this was about $15 and I got at least I think I think I probably got like four yards of this yeah so I kind of just used that I'm trying to attempt to take more pictures of myself and I actually took one other day and it came out really cute so you know I'm just trying to you know add some little things to do in my spare time but yeah guys this is the beauty room this is where everything happens and I just thought I should come in here and show you guys you know I feel like there's a couple things in here that you know anybody might want to look at but yeah this is it but yeah let me know what you think of the video if you guys have any you know suggestions that you want to add let me know you know if you guys know something that i can put on my wall please tell me i've been thinking about those neon lights so i might get one of those i don't know i'm debating okay but yeah i'm gonna go i'm gonna get out of here because i'm kind of hungry so i gotta go find something to put in my stomach so <laughs> i will see you in my next video all right to be safe guys